Investigators west of Atlanta are looking for a young boy taken from his home. CBS 46's Savannah Louie just made it to Harrelson County where everyone there is trying to find four-year-old Braden Dobbs. Savannah. Yeah, I just spoke with family less than 20 minutes ago. They shared with me the circumstances surrounding this shooting and abduction. They say that Lee Dobbs was shot outside of his home here earlier this morning. He was able to crawl inside where his other children found him and called 911 as his four year old was taken from the home. Police are now looking for four year old Braden Lee Dobbs. He was last seen around six o'clock this morning. He's about three feet tall and about 40 pounds. They believe the little boy is with his mother and a trite boy Dobbs. She may also go by the name Anita. According According to, to social media, she could either be driving a white Chevrolet Tahoe with the license plate RIL7846 or a black Dodge Charger with unknown plates. But investigators say this morning, Anita and another man came to the home of her estranged husband, Lee. A struggle took place and Lee was shot in the chest near the outdoor side porch. It's unclear who shot him, but again, we're told that Lee crawled back inside of his home where his kids were the ones who called 911 and other family members. I'm told that Lee's 12 year old son is the one who performed chest compressions until first responders arrived on the scene. Neighbors say they think Anitride was driving again that black Dodge Charger or a white uh, a white uh, Chevrolet Tahoe um, and she is at a 42 year old woman who stands at about five foot two. Now Lee is in the hospital recovering. He has had surgery. We're working to learn more information surrounding the scenario, but his family asks that anyone with any information come forward for now reporting from Harrelson County Savannah Louis CBS 46 News.